And they're off, and Super Romance leaves hard for Dave Miller. Going on a break is Victory Vixen, who jumped into the first turn. Yarborough and Ray Paver away well, and Anna Banana for Ledford firing out of there. They're now neatly up into second position. Racing in fourth is Armbro Vagabond. Cressida Hanover parked and pressing on for LaChance, and she's trotting up, and Anna Banana quickly vacates the two-hole. Ledford committed to try for the lead with her, and Anna Banana swoops by Super Romance to grab command. Cressida Hanover up into third. She has room to drop in there. Yarborough Arborough in behind her fourth. The quarter was in 29 and three. Racing in fifth is Armbro Vagabond. Then it's two lengths to Miss Madison Rose, who's showing the whip in sixth position. Racing in seventh is handover to Money Honey, and Jeff Fout tips her to the outside from the seventh spot. And far behind, following the gate break, is Victory Vixen as they trot down the back stretch. So it's Anna Banana trotting smoothly on a two and a half length lead. Super Romance trying to keep touch with her in second. Cressida Hanover keeps throwing in steps. Lachance has kept her flat. So far, though, Yarborough first up on the outside takes over third. The half was in 59 and one. Second over, Armbro Vagabond for Jim Matinas. She's getting carried into the action now, just four lengths from the lead. Followed third over by handover to Money Honey, who ranges up into sixth. Miss Madison Rose shuffled a bit as seventh on the inside, and Victory Vixen still struggling far behind, trailing the field. And Anna Banana is the one to reel in here as they head to the three-quarter marker. Armbro Vagabond setting it up second over, and now Matinas wheels her out three wide but has four lengths to make up as they hit three quarters in 130 flat and come to the top of the stretch and Anna Banana has drifted out a couple of paths but still has the lead. Armbro Vagabond tries to rally. Super Romance with plenty of room up the rail. Racing in fourth, Miss Madison Rose but it's Armbro Vagabond trotting strongly on the outside and she's swooped by to grab the lead. Miss Madison Rose from between horses trying to nab second from a drifting Anna Banana but it's Armbro Vagabond. Armbro Vagabond wins it. Miss Madison and Rose was second, Anna Banana drifting third, 159 and four. The Horseman magazine will be on sale at that special booth on the apron down toward the clubhouse area here at the Red Mile after this race. So you can pick up your Chasing Tail Kentucky Futurity edition of the Horseman and Fair World, also with that nice article on Pear Erickson at the stand located on the apron area. Erickson's longtime assistant, Jonas Kernison, will be opening up a stable of his own, remaining in the United States, retaining some of the horses, and also taking on new clients as well. So Per Erickson, who will be relocating back to Sweden, one of Trotting's true masters, trains the first race winner, Armbro Vagabond. <laughs> 